You want bacon? Well, we got it here. I'm Kevin Gillespie, and this is The Bacon Show. We're about to head to the subway. We're going to catch the train and head over to Brooklyn to go check out this place called Lucy's Lounge. Apparently, they do some bacon cocktails and some pretty mean bacon popcorn. Let's go in here and see what's going on. How's it going, guys? Hey there, everybody. I'm Kevin. Lucy. Hey, Lucy. Nice to meet you. You're not nearly as pretty of a woman as I thought you were. So made. I keep getting on. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I hear you guys do some pretty good bacon drinks. You heard right. We make ourselves a pretty darn good Bloody Mary with uh, our uh, bacon-infused tomato juice. That sounds fantastic. So yeah, and then we have some bacon popcorn to turn you on to as well if that's not enough pick for you. Let's do it. Let's do yeah. it. That sounds awesome. So well, what do you want first? All right. I want to see this bacon popcorn. Popcorn <laughs> comes back to a cocktail. Let's sounds do this. Sounds good. Thing. Awesome. All right. <laughs> now, trying to maximize space. <laughs> Customers ask, you know, the recipe for the bacon popcorn, right. and I tell them it's the simplest thing. It's four ingredients. You need a small pig, <laughs> half a bushel of corn, an F-150 pickup truck. You got one of those, and some really good jumper cables. Sweet. So, single pot, one batch at a time, just like my mother used to do on the stove. The key to the bacon and popcorn is the bacon salt. All the oil, all the moisture that's coming out from the inside, it's gonna be great and and moist. So while it's moist, within the first two minutes, put the very pulverized seasoning, which is pretty much the meat from the bacon, kosher salt, ground really fine. Always one more. All right. Then we get the bacon salt. Hot man. And then of course, just a little bit of the bacon dripping. That's your brand, better than butter, bacon, it, oil. It covered, yeah. <laughs> covered good. That is bowl of popcorn. Look at that. That is bowl of popcorn. Oh my God, God. blush bacon. <laughs> that is phenomenal. Now we want to go get, All right. get a drink on top of that. Let's do it. We can get we can get you a bigger bowl. So Kevin. In this glass here, before I've added the ice for your cocktail, what you have in there is a uh, shot of our house vodka, Watka from Poland, fantastic uh, grain vodka. Um, also uh, about, I'd say, three ounces of our uh, bacon-infused tomato sauce, which we brown with garlic and bacon fat, and the usual uh, components of a Bloody Mary. Homemade horseradish, freshly ground pepper, freshly squeezed lime juice, a little bit of hot sauce in there, and a little bit of Worcestershire. Then what I'm gonna do is salt the rim. It has big chunks of bacon mixed in with kosher salt. Something like that usually works for me. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna shake it and I'm gonna strain it over fresh ice. You don't want your drink watering down in your glass. A lot of places will just transfer it into the glass. We're gonna leave that about that way from the, from the rim. And we'll go ahead and put a, some pickled sugar snap peas in, out of the olives. <laughs> Builds up the suspense. I have to stare at it for a little while. <laughs> Did you want a few pickled jalapenos? Yes, I'll have just, yeah. You can just dump that. <laughs> I'm just gonna grab a whole bunch and throw them right on top. Yes, sir. And brother, Prepare yourself. That's a meal in a glass. There we Enjoy, go, right my here. friend. <laughs> yeah, what else do you need? All right, yeah, this is the best Bloody Mary I've ever had. <laughs> you guys are a twofer here. So is this brunch, you're like, at brunch we serve the Bloody Mary, i.e. we have this bowl of popcorn and these Bloody Marys. Do you, do you, do you need more? No, <laughs> brunch is just a time of day. Yeah. We've, we've been known to serve a couple eggs here and there too, but uh, yeah, I think you got the right idea, Kevin. Phenomenal. You know, thank you so much. Thank you. I do think that sometimes people take it overboard. They put bacon in something, and that's all you taste. I still want to taste Bloody Mary. Mm -hmm. um, and that's it just exactly adds right. a nice new depth to it. With the bacon, what I've discovered is that just the basic thick cut slab regular. Don't don't throw all the crap in there that right. I didn't ask you for. I didn't ask you for apple cherry wood kind of thing. Right, right. I just wanted bacon. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> you know? No need to reinvent the thank wheel. Thank you. Yeah. It's bacon. Exactly, exactly. I love it. Yeah. Thank you, thank you. Yeah. This is one of those things that if I could sneak it back in my pockets in the plane, I would. Um, we shall learn to go. <laughs> it's awesome. I appreciate you letting me come in and check yeah, it out. Yeah, man. Thank you for Cheers. coming in, man. One for the road? One for the road. Cheers. 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 If you want more bacon, make sure you subscribe.